Mihiki Okoto. Here is the starting list for the final race of the day. Open Men W6500 final. Ite ara tua tahi ko Team Pineula. Tua rua ko Herbert on tua. Tua toru waka manu red. Ko Makaira. Team Goodyear. Team Kina. Tau peke surfers. E rugged extreme. Ite ara tua waru. E hika. Hotudo, this is going to be a good race. Team Pine Ula coming in with the fastest time and lane two, Herbert's on tour. Yeah, out there in lane eight, we've got the team from uh, Horota Wakahoi. Uh, they've got a few experienced paddlers in there. Lane seven, Rutene Gable in number one seat there. Just pulling the front of his kuna across, setting it up for the start. Lane six, Team Kina Mitimitangole Pacifica from Whangareng. Uh, they've been here for a while. Team Goodyear, they've been always great showers in the finals here. And once again, out there in lane five. Lane four, Makaida from Mana Pacifica Africa Canoe Club from the Wellington region. And there in lane three, Vaka Manuret Manuka Africa, who's been showing well in all the divisions uh, in adult racing. Ahoy Horo Herbert's on tour, a team made up of a lot of friends and brothers and an uncle in there. And in lane one, Team Penehula Portage Crossing, the fastest qualifiers for this event. This is the big event of the day. Yes, Team Penehula, they took this out last year. They just beat them, but there, lane eight, you can see, looks like Hemi Wahapango is their number one, taking them in with a stroking, but they're getting ready for this race, and this is the biggie of the event. 500 metres, all in all, everything is put into this. Three months, over three months of hard work for some of these teams. They've been training day in, day out, sometimes two times, maybe even three times a day for these events, and it all comes down to this and if you ever look at the water it's a bit choppy there right now yeah we've got a little bit of uh wind blowing across the top there blowing these teams in and we've got a start we've got a start pineula here team pineula from portage crossing they don't want to give this up they don't want to give this away and they've stretched out and they're applying full power right from the start Yes, they're doing some quite nice strokes here. Team Pineula from Portage Crossing. It's going to be a tough fight here. Baka Manu Red from Manuko Outrigger Canoe Club in lane three. They don't want to give it up. They've all had very close times, around 146 for this uh, throughout the heats and the semi-finals. Lane two, Herbert's on to Amahoy Huru. They're sticking right in the middle. It's going to be a very close race here. Team five, lane five from Team Goodyear. Hey, Mato Paddlers, they were last year's second place. Get us here, Huru Tawakahoi, Rugged Extreme, out in lane eight. Secrets of these kinds of races when it's getting tight like this is to stay relaxed, listen to the calls, make sure you get your changes right and look at this at the halfway mark, Team Pineula has got a half a canoe advantage over everybody else. Yes, Team Pineula from Portage Crossing are out first. Herbert's on to a second from Ngahoi Huru. Baka Manu Red coming in third from Manuko Outrigger Canoe Club. They have just got to stay out front, Team Pineula from Portage Crossing. If they can keep this up, they will be all right. But there is a definite challenge coming in now from the Herbert's on to Ngahoi Huru Canoe Club. They are in lane two. They will be wanting to push forward to try and tip these ones at the line. It's going to be a close race or two. Yes, it's pretty close, but Team Pineula at around about the 300 metre mark picked up their rate. They picked up their rate. They maintained that strength that they were driving at the start of this race, and they coming through. Look, they're reaching out. Their paddles are driving in solid into the water, and I think lane one, the canoe's leaping out of the water as they charge through. The spray's flying. The paddles are flying, and Team Pineula are the champions for 2010. Second, it's a close one. It may have been lane three or even lane five. Lane three, Bakamanu Red. Lane five, Team Goodyear. They have pushed in, but let's have a look. Here are our open men's champions for 2010. Team Pineula from Portage Crossing. They have taken it two years in a row. Let's have a look at the replay. Lane one, they are a one canoe length, one waka length ahead. They throw their paddles up in the air. And second place, let's have a look. It's a close one between lanes two, three, and five. And it looks like it is lane three. Three takes the silver medal, five takes the bronze medal, lane three, Bakamanu Red, lane five, Team Goodyear, but there are our champions in lane one, Team Pineula from Portage Crossing. What a great race, David. What a great race, these guys. They punched out of the start with extreme power. They lifted the canoe up out of the water in the start and they kept that canoe flying all the way through to that halfway mark. They secured the lead and never let it go. Yes, that three deep at the start. They had three major powerful strokes right at the start, which lifted their waka up. 
got them out ahead, and from there they just stayed right there. Shannon Moon right there, and here are our results. Tua tahi tēnei o ngā whakataitai. Team Pineula, 143.71. Tua Rua Baka Manu Red, 147.87. Tua Toru Team Goodyear, 147.92. I mean, 143 Hotu, they were doing 146. They've taken three seconds off that time. A very, very good uh very, very good for this team, Pineula, for the second time in a row. That's a great time, David. That's a great time. Then these guys should be happy. These guys should be proud. They'll be backing their waka in now. Um, the adrenaline's still in there. They've still got a bit of a rush going on. And uh, they just need to just bring their canoe in now and just take things easy and celebrate. Uh, congratulations to them. These are the best. Uh, this is the best team for Wakama Nationals 2010 for the 500 metres. There's Shannon Moon putting up his finger, number one. They are very happy indeed. Yes, Shannon Moon. He's he's just shown everything uh, that's required to be the champion, David. Yes, he has. Ete iwi. This is us. This is Māori Television giving it to you. Waka Ama live here at Karapiro for 2010. From all of us here, we want to thank you very much for coming to watch. Ete iwi. Ngā mihi mata koro koro. Ngā mihi mata kui kui kia koutou katoa. Ete iwi. Tēnā koutou. Tēnā koutou. Māori ora kia tātou katoa.